Baccarat, also called Punto Banco, is a casino game in which players place bets after being dealt cards from a container called a shoe. Baccarat is a game of chance, not skill, and the odds are set to favor the casino. At least, that's what the casino tries to do. Marina District Development vs. Ivy features professional card players who manage to tweak the odds in the other direction. Professional poker player Philip Ivey approached Borgata Hotel Casino and Spa in Atlantic City, seeking to play high-stakes baccarat. Citing superstition, Ivey requested several accommodations, including a dealer who spoke Mandarin Chinese, one eight-deck shoe of Gemico Borgata playing cards to be used for all play, and an automatic card shuffler. He requested that his colleague Cheng Yen Sun be allowed to sit next to him. Ivey placed large bets and attracted other gamblers, so the casino acceded to his requests. Ivy and Soon were actually engaged in an elaborate scheme known as edge sorting. Soon used slight differences in the edge patterns on the backs of the cards to identify the value of the card's faces. She would direct the dealer to turn cards in certain ways the first time through the deck. This arranged the cards so that she knew their values. Ivy used these substantially improved odds to win more than $9 million. Borgata learned that a London casino had accused Ivy of running an edge-sorting scam. Borgata sued Ivy for fraud, alleging that Ivy misrepresented his requests for accommodation as grounded in superstition. It also sued him for breach of contract based on the gambler's agreement to play in accordance with the New Jersey Casino Control Act. On both parties' motions for summary judgment, the court considered two issues, 